Hello, my friends. My name is Ellen. If you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. If you're new to my channel, welcome to my Southern Kitchen and the 383rd episode here on Ellen's Homemade Delights. Hope all you're doing well and staying safe and healthy. Today, I'm going to share with all of you a Southern Butter Pound Cake. And my friends, it is the bomb.com. It's going to be so delicious. And as always, it is so simple and easy to make. And the best part about this recipe is semi-homemade. We're going to use a cake mix, but we're going to doctor it up by adding some other ingredients that taste like you spend hours in the kitchen. Y'all going to love it, love it, love it. And I'll post a complete recipe along with the instructions down below in the description box. And also check out my pound cake recipes playlist and my previous video, Gullah Red Rice. I'll post a link to both of those down below in the description box. So grab your cake mix, your eggs, and your butter sugar, because we're about to bake some butter pound cake magic in my southern kitchen. Here we go. All right, my friends, in my large bowl, I have a half a cup, which is one stick of unsalted butter that let come to room temperature. And into our butter, we're going to add in one cup of white sugar. And we're going to cream these on medium speed until it's fluffy. All right, my friends, next we're going to add in three jumbo eggs that let come to room temperature. Going to add them in one at a time. Mix those in until they're well incorporated. All right, now it's time to add in the extracts. One teaspoon of pure vanilla extract and one teaspoon of natural butter flavoring. And here's the ingredient that's going to make this pound cake super duper moist. We're going to add in one cup of mayonnaise. And make sure you use real mayonnaise. And we're going to blend all this together until it's well combined on medium speed. Alright my friends, now it's time to add in our last few ingredients. In this bowl I have one cup of all-purpose flour with a fourth of a teaspoon of salt and one package of golden butter cake mix or you can use yellow and I whisk them together until it's well incorporated and in my measuring cup I have two-thirds of a cup of my favorite ingredient evaporated milk and we're going to add the dry ingredients alternately with evaporated milk beginning and ending with the flour and cake mix mixture. Alright, last of the dry ingredients. Mix all these in until it's well combined. Alright, my friends, I'm through mixing up my cake batter. Look at this beautiful whipped batter. Mmm, it smells awesome. 
I can smell the butter flavoring. All right, perfect. Now we're ready to pour the batter into the pan. We're going to pour it in the 10 inch bun pan that agrees with baking spray. All right, my friends, now we're going to shake it and bang it to get some of those air bubbles out. All right, now we're ready to put this pound cake in the oven. We're going to put it in the preheated 350 degree oven and we're going to let it bake for about 60 to 80 minutes. All right, I'll bring you back. All right, my friends, I have taken my pound cake out of the oven. Mm, and it smells amazing up in this kitchen. So now I put it on the wire rack. I'm going to let it cool in the pan for 10 minutes. And then after that, I'm going to put it on my cake stand and let it cool completely. All right, my friends, there you have it. Semi-homemade Southern Butter Pound Cake. Thought that looked beautiful. And if you want, you can add a glaze on it. But I'm just keeping it simple. Alright, so now I'm about to fix me up a plate and I'll give it a taste. Alrighty, my friends. I have fixed me up a plate and I'm serving it with a scoop of vanilla ice cream. Now it's time for the best part, the tasting. Here we go. Oh yeah, look at that texture. Super moist. Mm-mm. Mmm. Light and airy. Full of buttery goodness. This butter pound cake is marvelous, my friends. Please give this recipe a try. This deserves another bite. Mm. Grab me a little ice cream. Yum o. Oh. Butter pound cake licious. My friends, many thanks so much for watching and joining me in my southern kitchen today. If you enjoyed this video and this recipe, please give it a thumbs up. I really do appreciate it. Don't forget to share this with your family and friends. Like, comment, subscribe to my channel, and click on the bell so that way you be notified when my new videos come out. And also, hashtag Ellen's Homemade Delights, or send me an email, Ellen's Homemade Delights at gmail.com. I would love to see your beautiful creations with my recipes. I'll see you next time. Let's eat, much love, and stay safe.